So many people out there fail, not because they don't have the ability, it's because they don't have the heart to go through adversity. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You'll go through some failures. When you're in that darkness, you want to sit there and wait for the light to come. But you can't wait. The only way out is to step forward, to face your fears, to become your own light. There's going to be a lot of times y'all about to fail. We are all a work in progress. But in that moment, I want you to remember the power of you. You will change the world. Even when you're struggling, even when you're discouraged, and you feel like other people have given up on you, don't ever give up on yourself. The indomitable will, if you have a belief, you can do something. The only way you grow that, like in the gym, you grow your muscles by actually exercising them. To grow the individual will to become something, you must get comfortable with fear and failure. They must be your best friends. They're the only one that moves that needle of life. Every hero you guys had was called an idiot, crazy, a loser. You must break society's status quo. Status quo is normality. It's alive but not living. It's death on a stick, guys. The belief of the individual overrides thousands of people with just intent. Safety, comfort zones are dead zones. You have to continue to push yourself because your true potential will never be matched, guys. Nobody is going to hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. Now, if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you got to be willing to take the hits. The future rewards those who press on. With patient and firm determination, I'm going to press on. I don't have time to feel sorry for myself. I don't have time to complain. I'm going to press on. Stop complaining. Stop crying. We are going to press on. We've got work to do. What's your why? What motivates you? What pushes you? What drives you? And if that thing is eternal, if nobody has to call you, if nobody has to prod you, if nobody has to reward you, if nobody has to give you anything, if you are self-motivated and self-regulated, you can have it, you can be it, you can do it. Take ownership. Take extreme ownership. Don't make excuses. Don't blame any other person or any other thing. Get control of your ego. Take ownership of everything in your world, the good and the bad. Take ownership of your mistakes. Take ownership of your shortfalls. Take ownership of your problems. And then take ownership of the solutions that will get those problems solved. Take ownership of your mission. Take ownership of your job, of your team, of your future, and take ownership of your life. And lead to victory. It's possible you can live your dream. It's necessary that you have a plan of action, that you're resilient, that you stick to, and you work with the system, that you have the vision and never give it up, that you become creative and relentless and keep on coming back again and again and again, and that it's you that you've got to take personal responsibility to make it happen, and that it's hard, easy is not an option, and when life knocks you down, jump back up and say, it's not over! Hunt